Dante. Welcome back to another Potatoes! Bear out. No one cares what I think. I'm more interested in what the people think about this. Dante. Clear as mud. Vermont. <laughs> Vermont! <laughs> oh Jesus. It started already. I have to admit, fellas, I've been uh, preoccupied as you know. So I have uh, randomly picked some beer notes. So uh, we'll see if we struck lucky with some. <laughs> Moving straight into it. Can. Slightly hazy. With soapy. Please. People have got a thing about soap in the beer tasting world. The aroma has lots of citrus, grapefruit, piney, subtropical fruits, lychee, soapy. Oh my god! The flavour is bitter with notes of citrus, grapefruit, piney, some tropical fruits, grassy citrus peels, green, dunk, dry. Medium bodies. <laughs> Cask of beer merchants. It pours hazy, cloudy, dirty, gold. <laughs> With a small white head, the aroma is sweet, sticky, apricot, mango, peach, pine dust, marmalade and bubblegum. The taste is dry, better, green, powdery. My gosh! Powdery. We've been through it before. It's not a taste. Grassy herbal mango, tin fruits, flavour bread. With a drying finish. Medium body and fine. Foamy carbonation. A bit green and chalky, but not bad. We've all got Google. Prada Menantile. Prada Menantile. Prada. Prada. Right. Bread. I'm in. 33 centiliter can. Aroma. Fruity and zesty, predominantly due to hops. No malt smell. Appearance light, almost clear, and has a weak head, which dissipates almost immediately. Taste fruity sweetness. Mm -mm. No bitterness, at least not for me. Oh, lad, it's not bitter enough for him because he's a real man. No sourness. Well, that's, that's fine. <laughs> Definitely tastes like stone fruits, mainly apricots. Palate, thin and soft carbonation with an abrupt finish. Overall, not an expensive beer and quite nice. Would recommend to a friend who likes light beers. Would pair with freshly roasted cashews. Mm. I always freshly roast my cashews. Are you finished, Mr. Slade? Never no, buy them. Just Ready up. roasted. 25th of May, 2018. Intense tropical fruits, mango, papaya, passion fruits. <laughs> Maracuja, pine, bit of wet straw. Hazy gold, medium, medium, medium. <laughs> Creamy white head, light bitter. More tropical fruits, bitter mango peel. How do you know what mango peel tastes like? How does anyone know what mango peel tastes like? Unless they are biting it like an apple. Green papaya, passion fruits. <laughs> Get it right. Citrus fruits, tangerine, soft carbonation, medium bodied, pretty decent stuff, nice aroma, can from beer hogs, how good. Oh dear. Can it, hop and pork in Rome. <laughs> Misty, yellowish, poor, irregular and thick, off-white <laughs> foam, irregular head. Quiet down, Kiza. You're dicking the audio. Nose, extremely citric. Lemon zest, jasmine, a jasmine. Mouth, below the aroma, in my opinion. A bit thin, super dry with a vegetable hint. Mm. Oh. Can from Cotteridge wines, pours cloudy, paste, 
Pause cloudy. Paste. Lemon. Melon. Vape smoke. Vape smoke. How would you describe the pouring of this beer? Mm, pouring like vape smoke. Bitter fruit finished quite good, really. Mm. Can. Picked up from Brewdog Oxford. Consumed at home. Sat down the garden. By the pond. <laughs> Saturday. The 19th of May 2018. I was just about to start cooking. <laughs> I was just about to start cooking buttermilk chicken with chipotle slaw. He forgot he was doing a beer review. Pause hazy yellow with a white head. Not too much on the nose. Light, fruity, but not a lot else. A touch thin in mouth. Refreshing maybe. Some light lemon sherbet. And weak orange squash. <laughs> but not a lot else, okay? No, it's not okay. How did the buttermilk chicken turn out? <laughs> oh God, I am, I... Sometimes, it astonishes. <laughs> where they were going with it. They clearly sat down to write a post about the beer. Beer notes. Why start it off with a... With a <laughs> no, I really need to put them in the scene. I need to tell them where I was, what I was doing, what we were eating. A6, A4, T6, P3, OV, 13, 3.2. They could be coordinates to his pond. Short but sweet this this week. <laughs> Short but sweet. Even the shortest of pretentious beer notes can be. <laughs> oh Jesus. Mmm. In my opinion, um, I could really eat some buttermilk chicken right about now with some freshly roasted cashew nuts. Mmm. Good lord. But that wraps it up, fellas. So as always, don't forget to thumb up this video because you are Don't forget to hit the like and hit subscribe. Click you more so I'll come next to the video. Oh, just see it all next time. I'm out of here. Are you finished, Mr. Slade? No, I'm just getting warmed up.